Hello, welcome to Talented Developer. For latest update and notification please subscribe our YouTube channel. Hi guys, so today we are going to learn how to create a product and plan using the Stripe dashboard. So first of all welcome everyone. Now we are going to learn how to create the product plan. So first of all you have to log in your Stripe account. Once you have logged in then you will comes under dashboard section. Here if you come and click into the billing menu option after that you have to come under the sub menu of products. Once you will click here it will come your all the products. Initially I don't have any product so you can see here blank option is there so you can create a new product. Once you click here after that you can see what is the heading here it, it is showing like create a product so what is a product product means like an example of water bottle you are having a water bottle that contain any name okay so i am going to give here name like test product okay and after that here you can give unit level like 30 dollar for 10 seat or api call it depend on you i'm not going to give anything here and one is their statement descriptor so this is important like when you will generate to your bill on that time it will show the name so it depend on you if you want to give you can give otherwise you can skip also so i'm just going to copy this old name and i'm going to paste here so once you click here after click you can see product has been created now you have to add some price okay so suppose i said earlier you are having a water bottle of any brand definitely some price is there that means like you have to pay that price then you can get that thing so definitely if you are having any product you need some pricing plan so here you can create multiple pricing plan for one product like example suppose you are having an product and you want to charge different from different different countries so for like us you can charge some different amount for india you can charge different but only one product is there so you can easily come and create here so here is like you can see here it you have to give a nickname nicknames like you can easily remember so suppose if you are going to create a monthly you can just give your monthly name okay so this is like a one kind of reminder and here is id if you will not enter anything then a stripe will automatically generate the id otherwise you can give your manual okay so here in pricing we are having two options so in last videos we have discussed earlier one is recurring and one is meter so initially we are going with recurring quantity okay so it by default it will be selected next here you can choose your currency okay so by default it is a US dollar okay let's go so here it is no it depend on you if you need multiple price you can click so now this is the initial and crucial also so here you can enter the amount how much dollar you need so I'm just going for give the ten dollar okay and here you can give daily basis weekly monthly quarterly yearly it depend on you if you need custom also you can come and click on the custom it will be created here now if you come below and here you can see a customer subscribe to one unit will be built ten dollar okay so here you can see how much the customer have to pay now we are having a trial period what is trial period trial period means like initially you are going to give this offer to the customer like first month i'm not going to charge ten dollar but after that i'm going to charge you so if you need you can give so i'm going to give you 28 days so suppose any customer will subscribe this plan he will get 28 dollar free okay like means like sorry 28 days free for this 10 dollar amount okay after that once you click here now you can see i'm having a product okay that name is test product amount is 10 dollar per month if you need to add multiple price you can come and add okay this is the one id that id we are going to use in future so in next video we are going to learn how to create this product and plan using the backend api currently i'm showing with ui so any developer can easily understand how it's working 
so it will be helpful to understand in backend phase here you can see pricing plan okay next is metadata metadata we will discuss later because if i explain it is not beneficial right now and you can see whatever you will do here logs will be generated so first step we have created a product next was plans okay suppose if you click here in the plan you can see here the whole details like summary okay and this is the request we have requested okay initially we did not see because we are using dashboard but we will see once you will use in back inside so this is a response this response is very crucial in future we can easily understand okay so here see uses type is license license means like you are going to charge monthly one is like meter type here see trial period is 28 days this is the response so in next video we are going to learn how to create the product using backend api thanks guys